Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering exam. Today we are going to see the MCQ related with wastewater engineering. So the first question, for determination of average annual precipitation in a catchment basin, the best method is option A, arithmetical method, option B, decent mean method, option C, isohedral method, option D, none of the above. So the correct answer is option C, isohedral method. Next question, a hydraulic jump in the Control meter will be formed above the control if its original option A depth is more than critical depth, option B depth is less than the critical depth, option C depth is equal to the critical depth, option D none of the above. So the correct answer is depth is less than the critical depth. Next question Professor Running suggested the method for extending the discharge curve. It is known as option A logarithmic curve, option B Y method, option C general method, option D none of the above. So the correct answer is option A logarithmic method. Next question If Y is the depth of water at any section, then the mean velocity is option A 0.1 into Y, option B 0.2 into Y, option C 0.3 into Y, option D 0.6 into Y. So the correct answer is option D 0.6 into Y. Next question The runoff is affected by option A type of precipitation, option B rain intensity and duration of rainfall. Option C Direction of prevailing storm Option D All the above So the correct answer is Option D All the above Next question For computing the runoff volumes of large areas The number of infiltrations used Option A 2 Option B 3 Option C 4 Option D 5 So the correct answer is Option A 2 Next question. From the survey of India map, the distance of the critical point is 20 km and the difference elevation is 193 meter. The over land flow time is option A 2 hours, option B 3 hours, option C 2 hours and 30 minutes, option D 4 hours. So the correct answer is option D 4 hours. Next question. If the area of strom hydrograph is equal to 102 cm, the ordinates of the unit hydrograph may be obtained by the dividing the ordinates of the strom hydrograph by option A1, option B2, option C3, option D4. The correct answer is option D4. Next question. If the potential infiltration of watershed having a soil with fair posture cover is 10 cm and rainfall is 12 cm, the direct runoff is option A 2 cm, option B 3 cm, option sorry, option B 3 cm, option C 5 cm, option D 8 cm. The correct answer is option C 5 cm. Next question. The quantity of water retained by the subsoil against gravity is called option A yield, option B porosity, option C specific yield, option D specific retention. So the correct answer is option D specific retention. Next question. Aquifer is 0.5 mm and hydraulic gradient is 1 in 80. The velocity of flow is option A 0.25 meter per day, option B 0.5 meter per day, option C 0.75 meter per day, option D 1.25 meter per day. The correct answer is option D 1.5 meter per day. Next question. Shredding is provided in option A cavity type tube wells, option B slaughter type tube wells, option C strainer type tube wells, option D perforator type tube wells. The correct answer is option B slaughter type tube wells. Next question. The efficiency of the pump may be taken as option D 0.55, option B 0.6, option C 0.65, option D 0.7. The correct answer is option C 0.65. Next question. For the estimation of high floods in the fan shaped catchment, the formula used is option A Dickens formula, option B Revis formula, option C English formula, option D none of the above. The correct answer is option C English formula. Next question. Surge tanks are used option A for storage water. Option B to increase the velocity in the pipeline. Option C as overflow valves. Option D to guard against water hammer. The correct answer is option D to guard against water hammer. 
Next question, as per IS 0172-1963, water required per head per day for average domestic purpose is option A 50 liters, option B 60 liters, option C 85 liters, option D 135 liters. So the correct answer is option D 135 liters. Next question, in slows and filters, the turbidity of raw water can be removed only up to option A 60 mg per liter, option B 75 mg per liter, option C 100 gram per liter, option D 150 mg per liter. The correct answer is option A 60 mg per liter. Next question, biochemical oxygen demand of the safe drinking water must be option A nil, option B 5, option C 10, option D 15. So the correct answer is option A nil. Next question, acidity in water is caused due to option A mineral acids, option B free CO2, option C iron sulphate, option D all the above. The correct answer is option D all the above. Next question, the transitional middle portion of the logistic curve follows option A, a geometric growth, option B a logarithmic growth, option C a first over curve, option D a constant rate. The correct answer is option D a constant rate. Next question, the velocity of flow does not depend upon option A grade of sewer, option B length of sewer, option C hydraulic mean depth of sewer, option D roughness of sewer. The correct answer is option B length of sewer. Next question, the specific retention is least in the case of clay, option B, option A clay, option B sand, option C silt, option D coarse gravel. So the correct answer is option D coarse gravel. Next question, most commonly used pump for lifting water in water supply mains is option A axial flow pump, option B reciprocating pump, option C rotary type pump, option D centrifugal pump. The correct answer is option A axial flow pump. Next question, economic height of the dam is the height corresponding to which option A cost of the dam per unit of storage is minimum, option B amount of silting is less, option C cost of dam per unit storage is maximum, option D free board provided is least. So the correct answer is option A cost of dam per unit of storage is minimum. Next question, distribution mains of any water supply is normally designed for its average daily requirement option A 100%, option B 150%, option C 200%, option D 225%. So the correct answer is option D 225%. Next question, if the pH value of water option A 7 water it is said to be neutral option b less than 7 is said to be acidic option c more than 7 is said to be alkaline option d all the above so the correct answer is option d all the above again we will see in next video thank you